Vince McMahon is plotting WWE return and he has notified the board of directors of his desire to return. Hey there everyone, you're watching the latest. I'm your host Denise Salcedo and we got a major update on Vince McMahon so let's jump right in. Vince McMahon is making a play to return to WWE. As first reported by the Wall Street Journal, Vince McMahon plans to return to WWE in order to pursue a sale of the company. McMahon is said to have notified WWE that he will not, as majority owner, quote, support or approve any media rights deal or sale if he was not named executive chairman to lead a review process. McMahon was quoted in a press release on Thursday. WWE is entering a critical juncture in its history, with the upcoming media rights negotiations coinciding with increased industry-wide demand for quality content and live events and with more companies seeking to own the intellectual property on their platforms. The only way for WWE to fully capitalize on this opportunity is for me to return as executive chairman and support the management team in the negotiations for our media rights and to combine that with a review of strategic alternatives. My return will allow WWE, as well as any transaction counterparties, to engage in these processes knowing they will have the support of the controlling shareholder. McMahon has also notified the company that he is electing himself and former company co-presidents George Barrios and Michelle Wilson to the board of directors. Three current members of the board will be required to vacate their positions as a result. Regarding the elections of Barrios and Wilson, McMahon said the following. Ms. Wilson and Mr. Barrios are highly qualified directors whose professional experience positions them well to help the company achieve the best possible outcomes in both initiatives. As former WWE co-presidents and board members, they are intimately familiar with industry dynamics and the organization's operations and have helped guide the company through past successful media rights negotiations. I look forward to working closely again with Michelle and George, as well as the company's remaining directors and management team, who have my full support and confidence. WWE has an exceptional management team in place, and I do not intend for my return to have any impact on their roles, duties, or responsibilities. McMahon is said to believe he will assume the role of executive chairman upon returning. However, WWE's board of directors would need to approve this. McMahon sent a letter to WWE in late December detailing his desire to return in order to spearhead a sales process. WWE WWE's board responded to McMahon that they are willing to work with him on a review process for a sale, but unanimously agreed McMahon returning to the company was not in the best interest of shareholders. The board also inquired as to McMahon's commitment to repay company expenses relating to the investigation into allegations of hush money payments. They also asked McMahon not to return to the company while government probes into the matter are ongoing. McMahon responded that he is willing to cover reimbursement for reasonable expenses incurred during the investigation that were not covered by insurance. However, he did not agree to return to the company while government probes are ongoing. This is going to be an ongoing story, so I will make sure to provide updates on further videos. But in order to check them out, make sure you guys subscribe to F4W online. And if you would like to chat more about this with me, feel free to hit me up on Twitter and or on Instagram at underscore Denise Salcedo, and I'll catch you on the next vid.